we look at the timeline over here, we will see that we have a red and green circle over here. And that if I now move over the timeline, you will see two dots appear. And this is because we have the ability to keyframe in the timeline and that we can keyframe in exactly the same way as we can keyframe in the level strip. So if we want to choose a specific frame, we use a dot which is closest to the view and we can choose specific frames and drag and drop the keyframes from the main keyframe. So we drag up If we select the dot over there and drag up, we will be able to extend it. If we select a random dot, we can extend it to that random dot only including those frames. And if we want a frame to be marked permanently, we just mark on the side there. 